Good morning, all of my dumpster peeps. Welcome to my morning voice. <laughs> We're gonna start this video off a little different today. I filled my car with so much pop, it took up the whole trunk. Also, we are gonna go to the no-kill shelter. I got some cat food, dog food, a big old bag of blue buffalo, and I put a bag together with some cleaning products for them. I'm gonna go get myself ready, and we can go deliver all this stuff and get back here and get ready for dumpster diving. Now, I know if you're wondering why don't we donate this to the Women and Children's or the Blackburn or da 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 da, because they don't need it. So when they don't need it, then I take it to the food bank. I showered, <laughs> put my face on. I was not showing you my face this morning, wolf. <laughs> it was rough. Anyway, um, we are on our way right now to drop off all of the dog food, cat food, and treats and supplies, all that jazz to the no-kill shelter. And we're gonna take this huge trunk load of soda to the food bank. Then after that, Beth and I will be going to the dumpsters and you guys will be coming with us. Hopefully we can find some really cool stuff in the dumpsters tonight. So let's go donate all these items and then I will see you guys later on tonight. And just like that, everything is gone. This is the food bank that I'm at right now. They are absolutely amazing here, I must say. They have a huge facility, and every time I come here, they are just so stinking sweet. I didn't film because I just didn't wanna make them feel like uncomfortable, you know what I mean? Like, cause they could see that my camera's here. But this is where I take all the soda whenever I mean, I donate a ton to the guys I work with, but they can only take so much, you know what I mean? Like I had a whole car load full. So um, the food bank always is happy to take it off my hands. Three hours later. It's finally time to go diving and you guys are coming with us. So I'm on my way to go meet Beth. Earlier today, you were with me. We hung out for a little bit and we dropped off some donations. And yesterday, Miss Tara came and picked up a ton of your donations that you guys sent to us and a ton of dumpster finds. So it's time to fill that game room up. But before we go dumpster diving, we need to have a word from today's sponsor. I wanted to take a minute to thank today's sponsor. Upside. Upside is an incredible free app for anybody who buys gas, groceries, or dines out. With every purchase that I make at the gas pumps, I'm actually earning cold hard cash back. To get started, all you need to do is download the free Upside app in the App Store or Google Play and use my promo code DDMO2 and you will get $5 or more cash back on your first purchase of $10 or more. Next, just claim your offer for whatever you are buying and pay as you usually would with your credit card or debit card. And you can cash out at any time to your bank account, to PayPal, to an e-gift card for Amazon, or many more. Now, you guys know that I am constantly putting gas in my car because I'm a dumpster diver. I drive all over to find all of these treasures that we find to donate to those in need. There's actually times where I put gas in my car two times in one night. <laughs> That is just crazy. So when Upside reached out to me, I was so super excited because you guys know I love me some free, right? Right. And I love to pass things on to you that are free, that can make you earn money. You have to pay for gas. You have to pay for groceries. I mean, we don't all have to dine out, but who doesn't like dining out? You know what I'm saying? So why not earn money back for doing the things you already have to do? 
I mean, it's a no brainer. It really is. Download the Upside app today. Remember, it is free. Oh yes, baby, it does not cost a thing. Oh nay nay, it is free. And there is a nothing better than free. Download the Upside app today. And remember, use my code DDMO2 and get $5 cash back or more when you spend $10 on your first purchase. Thank you again, Upside, for sponsoring today's video. And more importantly, thank you for saving me money at the gas pumps. Now, let's get back to Dumpster Dive. We're at the first dumpster, guys. Guess what's in here? Take a wild guess. Paper towels. What is with these paper towels? You can do it, Jimin. Awesome. We are at Party City. Gummy bears. That's awesome. It's all ripped up. It's all ripped up. There's costumes, but they're ripped. Well, we have some gummy bears, guys. Well, we're at Fab Blue. Is there anything good? All ripped? I don't know. Oh, maybe not. I wonder if there's stuff in this bag that's good. I think that bag under it has stuff. Yeah, I know, that's what I was just thinking. Definitely dump stuff in this one. Well, we'll just have to take it home. Sorry guys, my rake's in the way. We'll have to take it home and see. All right, clean up our mess. Now, back in the car, cause it's flipping cold. We are at Family Dollar and Sadly, they dumped out all the dog food they threw in here or ripped open the bags. But when I moved this, I noticed it said can liners and it was like kind of heavy. Look at all those garbage bags. They just threw them away. That's a ton of garbage bags. That's craziness. I mean, look at all those. Why would you throw garbage bags away? They're not like the best, no, but still. They're garbage bags. Just throw a bunch of plastic away for no reason. Right. That's a lot of work. Goodness. I wonder if they expired. <laughs> 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 oh, you know what? These look expired. We're going to throw these away. I hope there's nothing funky under here I'd stick my hand in. I know. Do you want these popsicles? Still in the wrap. I mean, oh, they're yeah. still in the wrap or another thing. They just, well, I guess because the summertime's over. Yep, they that's don't exactly wanna... why. That's crazy. Let me go get a bag. Yeah, these don't expire until 2024. That's ridiculous. Everybody still eats popsicles. Yeah, there's nothing. Not just in summertime. Shoot, I don't want that. Yeah, this is all cold stuff, so. All right, let's take our garbage bags and our popsicles and be on our way. All right, guys, we are at another Dollar General. There's a lot of wieners in here, but there's some pop, too. So I'm going to jump in here and get this little bit of soda over here. All right, Dr. Pepper. Look at all the wieners, guys. Grab it by that one. One that's dry. Grab it by that. There you go. That is it. Let's want some wieners. Alright, so this one, it looked like they had a bunch of face wipes or something in it. Oh, yeah. We got hand sanitizer, little ones. Underwear. We got a ton of these clean hands wipes. Sorry, I'm trying to show you guys. Here, I can hold it over there. Yeah, Beth will hold you. I'm better at grabbing and going. She's better at holding. Tons of these little hand sanitizers. Oh, look at that. $3 Aww. for that. That's crazy. There's tons of these hand sanitizers. What else do we got? Four of these wipes. Ew, I should have worn gloves. Some Starburst Juicy Fruit Gum. More hand sanitizers. More mini hand sanitizers. Oh, that one's cute. Little owl. This will be good for the K 
kiddos to put on their book bags. Antibacterial hand wipes. Thank you, Dollar General. Ooh, what do we got? Some nails. Some blue press-on nails. Oh, we got tons of stuff underneath this big box. Look at all those. <laughs> wow. All those hand sanitizer things. Oh man, too bad those are empty Red Bulls. Yeah. More of these things. No idea why they would throw that stuff away. Oh, the yogurt. Ugh. Why is everybody throwing their yogurt away today? <laughs> it's gonna fall out. Got it. Oh, those are so cute. Yeah, they are. That's a big old pack of antibacterial. All right, guys. We are at another Dollar General. Shocking, I know. <laughs> we stopped at this one earlier, but they were still open. So I don't think there's a lot, but there's some essential oils down there. And let's see what else we got. Look at that. Cute little leash for best mom's new puppy. Some Ziploc baggies that are wet. The bags are thankfully not. Hammer. Floral picks. Or fake flowers, whatever the heck they're called. Oh, there's some more baggies. Yeah, it has cheese in it. Oh, I'm seeing. We got a couple things at CVS and there's like a lantern in here and a little Santa. I don't know if they're broken or what but there's the Santa and then there's a lantern over there. I don't know if they're good or what but we're gonna find out. Let me grab little old Saint Nick over here and see what's up with him. He's perfectly fine. What's wrong with them? Mary and Bright Santa doesn't say how much. All right. I don't see like, oh my God, I must stepped on them. <laughs> Not so Mary and Bright after I crush his skull. Let's see what this is. Oh, I think it's broken. But that's so cute. That lights me. Oh, that's so cute. Alright, if I can, can you reach it? Right. Your mom would like that. Look at that, 40 bucks. Yeah, I can't believe, what did they say, broken glass? Yeah. yeah. You could take the glass out. Yeah, you could take all the glass out. Yep. Yeah. Your mom would love that. We are at another Dollar General, and guess what? There is so much stuff. Well, I don't know if it's so much, I think but it's cheese. <laughs> It's cheese? <laughs> I think the whole basket's full of cheese. Oh man, look at all these laundry baskets. Ah, oh, they are filled with cheese. What is that? Bug spray? Bug spray, you want that? I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't, I don't, I don't like that. using that stuff either. We got leggings. All right, let me get these baskets out of here. These are nice baskets. Yeah, there's nothing even wrong with them. No. Oh, I think Never mind. <laughs> $10. Got another broken monogram. Oh, there's a bunch of leggings there, I think. Is this broken? Yeah. 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 The rest is just boxes and stuff, but shoot, we'll take these. That's pretty awesome. Hey right, guys, we came to the last Dollar General. Sadly, there's nothing. So that is going to wrap up this night's dive but we got some pretty cool stuff so I know most of it we don't even know what we got from Walgreens so that's going to be a nice surprise for all of us and then we got all of those sanitizers and we got paper towels and 
all the laundry basket. So we did pretty dang good. So see y'all in the full reveal. Welcome to today's full reveal. Check out those cool Halloween decorations back there and oh, so much more. So that being said, let's dive right on in to everything Beth and I found at the dumpsters. The very first place Beth and I went was a Dollar General and wouldn't you know it, what was in the dumpster? A full package of paper towels. It's just ripped a little bit on the top. No water got in. They are perfectly fine. Then we headed to Party City. We didn't get a lot there. Actually, what did we get there? We got gummy bears there and I think they're in my car. But all it was was a large package of gummy bears with like the little individual packs. That's all we got there. Then we headed to Five Below and we grabbed two huge bags out. Now, sadly, the one they went ham was destroying. Like they squeezed silly string, they dumped glitter, they dumped nail polish, like you name it, it's dumped in the bag. So I really couldn't save a lot. There's more in the bag that's ruined than what we actually saved. This, I mean, it's just disgusting. There's so much stuff they destroyed. I just hate when they do that. Like, they're, like why? <laughs> You're throwing it away, you know what I mean? Ugh. Anyway, here is what we actually saved from Five Below, though. We got a little cute crisscross sports bra, size large. We got a pair of plain white women's socks, three pairs of gray, and three pairs of black, which as you can see has silly string and stuff on it, so I need to wash them. These two super cute cups that look like the Starbucks cups, and these ones both have a little chip in them. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, right there and right there, but they still work. They still close. We got two six foot phone chargers, waste bags for the puppers. We got this little pumpkin. It is missing a top, but I thought you could put a candle in that and that would look super cute. Two phone cases, the white and the green. And we got a foldable dual wireless charging stand. You guys seen Beth grabbing a bunch of Halloween decor. And I was like, oh my goodness, it's probably all destroyed. They love to destroy things there. Thankfully, they didn't destroy this very much. What they did is they ripped a lot of the heads, but I can hot glue these back on and they'll be just fine. But they didn't destroy the wiring. <laughs> so these are so stinking cool and I just have to untie this. And it'll look like this one, which I untied the one so you could see, like it'll just look like it's like flying in the air. You know what I mean? This one also works. So super cool, right? And we got two of these ones. And then this guy, I'm so super sad because they did rip the wiring out of this guy. All that happened though was his lights his lights, <laughs> his eyes lit up, but they of course ripped the wiring out, but that's okay because I can just paint green, like fluorescent green on the center of his eyeballs and it'll glow in the dark. That would be cool. But anyway, look at how stinking cool this guy is. That is a good score from Five Below because usually you are lucky if you get two things out of a huge bag or two. So I will take that. Then you guys seen we went to a few different Dollar Generals and we found a lot of cool things. Not a ton, but what we did find was super cool and all can be donated. So. Starting in the back, we have four really nice laundry baskets that were almost $11 each. We have a four pack of Starkist Tuna, a little bottle of Airwick essential oils, a rubber mallet that's what that's called i called it a hammer i knew it wasn't a hammer <laughs> we got some large ziploc bags a surge body wash a little dog toy we got this little bouquet of pink flowers of some sort little nylon dog leash and we got a little candle with the letter a on it three diet dr pepper six packs and one six pack of a regular dr pepper we also got this women's size two X. I thought these were leggings. It is a t-shirt and legging set. And look at how stinking cute that is, right? 
So that right there is a great donation. We also got all of these hand sanitizers. Why they threw these away is beyond me, guys. Like, does hand sanitizer go bad? But either way, everybody still needs hand sanitizer, especially kiddos in school. So these are perfect. These are just a little book bag hangy things. We got just the plain kind for girls and boys. We got little monsters, unicorns, little rainbows, llamas, spaceship. I mean, there's so many different kinds and we got a whole nother box. So that is amazing. Also got a bunch of these little um, hangy ones for like on their book bag. We have an owl one. An owl? <laughs> I don't know why it sounds weird when I say that. I'm really tired. <laughs> I didn't get home last night from diving until almost 2 a.m. Super fun. Anyway, nobody cares. We also got a bunch of these little Rexall hand sanitizers. We got all these different colors. Also got five bags of these antibacterial hand wipes. One of the Defender Plus antibacterial wipes. Beth found these size nine women's underwear. Sporty hipsters. <laughs> Lastly, I stopped at another Dollar General. You guys didn't see because the only thing we found was this basketball. Then you guys seen we went to Family Dollar. We, of course, got that huge box of garbage bags. Why they threw those out, I have no idea. Either way, those are a great donation. I'm going to take some to my work, and I will donate all the rest. And then we got all of these freezer pops. And just so you know, the expiration date, like Beth said, is 2024. I mean, it's just sugar water, so <laughs> I don't think it would really ever expire, but you get what I'm saying. We also stopped at a CVS, and you guys seen we saved a little St. Nick here. There's no price tag on him. I'm not really sure why he was thrown out. Either way, he's perfectly fine. And then I seen this lantern, and it screamed Beth's mom straight to me. It does work, as you can see. We just need to rip the try me wire out and put some batteries in and take all the broken glass out. But look at how, I mean, that is nice. And then last, didn't get the footage for you at Walgreens. I don't know what happened. I think we have the footage, but I think I erased it by accident. So, you know, whatever. Anyway, we went to Walgreens and when we walked up, there was a huge display. Like when they have like scrunchies and headbands, they have like the big display and the little like plastic hooks. They're just hanging on it. They literally threw away the whole display. So Beth and I just grabbed all the stuff that was left on it, which is all of these super cute headbands. Uh, we also got a package of scrunchies, two of those. And I apologize for my manly voice, but we all know when I don't get a lot of sleep, this is what I sound like. So sorry. One more headband. Then we got a grab bag. I have no idea what's in here. I do know there's some dog treats because when I ripped it open to like peek inside of it, I seen the dog treats, but I don't know like how many. And I'm dying to know how much these cost there. So I'm going to have to look these up and put the price up for you because we all know it wasn't cheap. But anyway, there's some chicken jerky. We got one, two bags of those. Let's open up the rest of the stuff and see what else is inside it. Oh goodness, yes. We got more chicken jerky. I will make sure that this is not on recall too. 11-17-2023, so it's not expired. I don't know if you can see that, it's in black. That's three, four, five, six bags of the chicken jerky. We also got six of these little four packs of lactation smoothies. December 2023 is the expiration. So, nope, they're not expired and they are shelf stable. So that's going to be a great donation to the diaper bank. There's apple pear and mango banana flavored. And that, my friends, is everything we found in the dumpsters. So, like I said, it wasn't a huge, massive haul, and we didn't get our normal fill the car to the roof type of stuff, but the things we did save are totally awesome, 
and great donations. I also wanted to take a minute and thank Upside again for sponsoring today's video. And if you guys are interested, which you should be because it's free and you get real money, then click the first link in the description box below. Thank you guys so very much for hanging out with us at the dumpsters and me today in the reveal. I, of course, will talk to you all in those comments down below. And until next time, guys, happy diving.